again, they're getting bigger. They are getting bigger. Pretty sure you won't be able to tell the difference between the adults and the little ones. Come on, go down. Don't make me go this slow the whole way down the, <laughs> the way. Come on. Come on. Come on. Should have just stayed up here. See me every day. Welcome back everyone. Today is technically day six. And again, I say day, but it doesn't mean I spent a whole day doing it. But the game plan is I'm going to take the rest of these trees down. And I've got all this space here. So I'm going to curve this back around. So I'm not going to go any wider than I am right now. And then just slope this down. So I've got all this out here that I can dig up. So I'm going to fill in a little bit more over here just so I can get at those trees and I can bury them. And then uh, I want to just fill in here so I can get onto that. And I'm going to start digging up. I'm going to get over there, start digging that, and moving that over here because I can take start cutting that whole corner off as well. Because if I take those branches down, I don't even have to take those trees down per se, but just uh, cut those branches and I can take that whole corner. So I shouldn't have to move anything more here. And it's probably going to look pretty good for continuing backwards. Let me get over there. So if I count from there, I really only need to fill into about here. So I can dig up all that. So hopefully, worst case is I'll just have to run some small lifts in. And with that, I could use the dump truck, my dump truck. Uh, but we'll see how much I can get out of there. So that's not for the moment. The moment is they get this corner done. So let me, uh, let me set up the cameras and uh, get ready to roll here.
here's a intermediary shot it's 12 30 i started about 11 I think it was about 11 by the time i finished watering the trees and doing everything so give you a good idea here this is basically going to be the slope right there so there's plenty here just have to uh, bush hog and clean up a little bit of that plenty of room i can take still take off that corner and like i said i probably brought too much dirt so i'm gonna have to move some of this back that way because i'm still gonna dig up what's here i'd rather move it 20 feet than have to bring it all the way from goose island they're still out there for now all right i just wanted to give you a quick shot in the middle because sometimes it's hard to find the with all the footage what i want to say so it's better to do it now so and i'm just letting the machine cool down a little bit it's 95 degrees today and she's starting to run a little hot i blew out the uh radiator but i really need to uh take take the whole screen out and uh, wash it but i'll do that when i get it on the other side so I'll let it run a bit and get back to it
hours of just uh, about three o'clock. Uh, today is Monday, and I made it. Made it. Corner is done, and I actually have more dirt. Like I said, <laughs> I was able to dig up more, but it's good because I need dirt down where the uh, overflow is going to go. That corner I left empty so that I could put in the pipe. So I'm going to stockpile some here, and I'm going to stockpile some here. Because I still have a lot to dig up. So I think I'm going to be pretty good, in pretty good shape to get this road down the way from, from what's going to be here. Um, I probably should have done that first. Dug that up, but that would make too much sense. It's hard to, it's hard to know uh, what's the best thing, but at least... I'll have this closer for that corner, and I'll also have it for when the dam needs to get filled up. So uh, anything extra that's down here, I'm not going to move it back. I'm just going to stockpile it for, the, for this corner, and then keep digging all this up, and hopefully there's enough in there. And if not, it's kind of like what, if you go back and watch the videos of when I did that end, um, I got to just about to the end, and then I had to, uh, I had to start borrowing some from over this side so we'll see how that goes but uh i'm happy i'm happy finally to the corner so i'll get a shot from the other side after and uh i'll catch everyone tomorrow thanks for watching well here's a shot from the other side so you can see started over there i don't know if this thing even focuses Hopefully, it's hard to tell on here. But I not only went past where I thought I was going to get to, I've, I just said it, I went past. Uh, so that's a good thing. And I got a lot of extra that I'm going to stockpile to use down. One overflow is going in that corner, and there'll be one in that corner. But that one is left open. So I can just put the pipe in and then go over top of it so that's about it tomorrow i'll be back at it dig up the rest of what i can stockpile it and then i'm going to start working down the way here so um i'll try to get a different video after as well um as i said i want to uh i want to get out that uh silt in island that's there or peninsula so i want to get rid of that so i might do that uh I'll go around this way and jump the jump the creek and uh, catch it on that side and get it out while it, before it rains. So actually see a few drops in there right now, but I don't feel any on me, so that's funny. Okay, well thanks for watching, and uh, I will catch you on the next one.